What's up, YouTube? This is Joe's Codes 101 back again with another video, and for this video, I'm going to show you my network file starter. Now, the way that this program works is obviously over networks, and I will show you how to use it. So, you would need to go into a network. I'm not going to blur these out because it's not really necessary. And you would go into one of your networks, say for instance, uh, this network, which is my computer that I'm currently on, you would drag the file onto the C drive or wherever you can access it. And yeah, or into the start menu if you want this program to run at startup, but that's not really necessary. Then you would go onto their computer and run this file. So here's the code for the file. Basically, it will look for the go file in the folder. If it is not there, then it will continue looking for it. If it is there, then it will run these commands. And so it can run both or just one or either one. And right now they're commented out with the two colons, so I will delete those two colons from this command. What this will do is it will start up a new CMD window, and in that CMD window it will say hi and freeze the screen. And this command right here will start Chrome and that website, which is google.com. So yeah, we'll just run the first command, which is saying hi in a new window. So we will open up this. We'll pretend we're on another computer doing this. Okay, we'll minimize that. When this file goes into this folder, a new window will pop up saying, hi, press any key to continue. Now we'll move to the next command, which is opening up Chrome and this website. You can open up Firefox or whatever, you just have to type in the name of the file for Google Chrome, it's just chrome.exe, and the address. So we will uncomment that out and comment this there. Now let's take this go file and put it back to this file, then we'll open it up. Minimize that, we'll put the go file in there, and then, wait for it, my computer is pretty slow, and there we are, it opens up Google Chrome, or Google.com, and yeah, so that's it. That's all I have for you today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please comment, rate, subscribe, and I'll see you again later. Goodbye.